hey guys welcome back again I am MJ in this video I will show you how to fix app or software closing automatically when you launch it that means when you open any software or app in Windows PC it's going to automatically close so how to fix this problem so first as a basic method is just right click on your taskbar go to task manager here it will show the running app so first close that app ok select it right click and click on end task and after this scroll down and here you will find the windows explorer so if you don't find windows explorer here just scroll down you will find the windows explorer in the bottom side okay so wherever you find windows explorer just select it and click on restart that's it these are first and the basic method to fix this problem if this not help the second option is go to start here type cmd or you can type command prompt and after this right click on the command from run as administrator ok click yes and here you type the simple code type sfc space power slash scan now type it and after type it hit enter it will take some time to complete the 100% so wait until 100% complete after 100% complete, close this window and reboot your PC. Okay? Restart your PC. So after this, try to use your app. The second method. If it's not work, then the next option is again go to start here. Type WS reset. Okay? Just right click on it and click on run as user. It will reset your Windows Store and after this here open the run command by pressing windows r and here type app cha cha and click ok now click on local now click on package ok select the packages open it under the packages search the microsoft ok here this one microsoft windows store underscore 8 w key so select this one and open it and under this one open the local cache and delete whatever you find here so simply right click on it and click delete from this folder so delete the data whatever found in the local cache folder and after this close this window ok and now try to open your app if it's not work then the next option is go to start go to setting go to apps and here search the app or find the app which is a creating problem to you for example uh, 3d pen not working for me so I'm going to find the 3d pen ok now that's right now just click on that and click on auto once options and here scroll down you'll find the option reset so whenever you feel any app not working properly so just reset it so this will permanently delete the app data on the device including your process so if you have signed in any app so you need to sign in again so you can do it so just reset it so after reset complete try to open that app so you can do this uh, to your other app for example your calculator not work so for example if your calculator not working so do the reset to your uh, app which is creating the problem so this is the third method if you don't find your app here like if you are using third party app like uh, your VLC player Adobe Reader so for this you need to uh, go to control panel and then click on programs and here go to programs and future so here find that app select on that and click on uninstall and reinstall so these are finally step you need to uninstall and reinstall the app which is not working properly in your PC ok and after this close this and if you are still facing problem you can follow the last step so for this you need to uh, go to this PC and then go to C drive 
then click on windows right click on it and click on properties and here go to security you need to add the one uh, group here so if the all application package is available that then you don't need to add it if the all package all application package is not available here in security then you need to add it so just click on advance and then click on change here you need to type in the capital all application packages and after this click OK and you can try check names and after this click OK so it will add and now you need to give the permissions so select the all application packages click on edit and after this allow the read and execute and allow the uh, list folder contents and allow the reads okay so after you allow these things just click OK and OK and after you reboot your PC and try to use the application so these are 4 or 5 stuff I have showed so let me know in comment which option or which method is work with you so thank you for watching guys catch you next video please like share and subscribe thank you very much